Anthony Hudson here for the clash between Collingwood and Fremantle. Today's game from Bendigo. I'm paired in the box here today with Gary Lyon. Welcome, Gaz. Hey, Hutto. Really looking forward to the start of this one. A practice match on the bill today as these two sides test each other out. Collingwood set to take on Fremantle in this exhibition match today. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. Fremantle, we've got a talented group in the middle. It's up to whether or not Collingwood can match them in the centre. We are the they run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Of course, Hutto. Side by side, they stick Captains converge for the toss of the coin. The Magpies winning the toss. Just waiting for the opening siren now. And here we go, it's Collingwood taking on Fremantle. It's a turnover with the ball now. Pushing it back. Gives away a free for in the back. Kick by Duffy. She finds herself in space and marks. Looks up with a kick. Antonio gains possession. Allen will be the recipient of the free. Puts it on the boot. Takes the mark. Moves the ball by foot. Good body work to win the mark. Hines kicks out of the congestion. Easily takes the mark. Goes with the kick. She takes the mark. Stewart doesn't want to let her teammates down with this kick. Takes that one strongly. Sharp to have the shot from outside 50. Okay. She decides to go for home. Couldn't complete the mark. Rushes with the kick. Great mark in the pack. Moves it by foot. The ball ends up going to ground. Hits her hard. Gets a handball away. Hines rushes with the kick. A chance to reload the attack now. Alex to kick it long. A big contested grab. Stewart sets her sights on the goals. She takes aim. Touched over the line. Livingston to bring it back into play. Good mark there. The kick from Alexander. Marking in space was Razzle. Get some distance on the kick. Both teams have struggled inside 50 early. Benici goes the long option. Coughed up by Kane. The ball spills to Kiyochi. Dishes it off. Almost cut it off. Gives a don't argue. Just put it on the boot. A mark by Horton. 50 metres from home. Sinks the slipper into it. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Dargan tucks it into the pocket. Benici running off for a break. Good opportunity for Fremantle to put a goal through here. 25 metres out. Stewart is going to need a good kick to put it through here. 
She heads for home. The kick ends up hitting the post. Fremantle by two points. Deciding where to go with the kick in. Livingston plays on. Looks to move it by foot. Nobody can hold on here. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Takes possession. Has it now. Lambert gets the loose ball. Rogue has it. A low stabbing kick. Off hands. Breeze. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. They can create from this. Releases by hand. She's got the footy in her hands. Falls pin. Thank you. Thump by Darcy. Great control there. A great defensive effort. Antonio collects it. Fremantle supporters delighted by that effort. Her teammates rush over. And we have the first goal of the match. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. Back in the middle now. Clears the contest. She gets her hands on the footy. Finds the loose ball. Hines brings it out of the pack. Grant couldn't stick the tackle. As we go into the break, the scores are Fremantle. Eight. Collingwood, nothing. Fremantle have come to play. They've got themselves in the game and need to push on now. Let's see what the stats have to show. Collingwood have been careful with their ball movement, taking plenty of uncontested marks and looking to find targets in space. Cheers, Gaz. The second term ready to get underway. Umpire ready to resume play. Big thump from Hines. Benici dug out the loose ball. Darcy takes it well. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. Going for goal number one. The kick connects with the post. Just two goals in it. Gooch weighing up the options now. Going for goal number one. What a fantastic goal. Leighton celebrating hard. The margin is now under a goal. Back in the middle now. Punches are clear. A chance for Davey. Just gets a hand in. The loose ball scooped up. Hacking it out of there. Nice hands. Goes by foot. Webb was surrounded. She needed to mark that, and she did. Umpire calls advantage. Gets the loose ball. Williams hurried kick. Good mark by Horton. 25 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number one. What a kick! And she puts it through! Gets some reward for her efforts. Fremantle by seven points. We're back in motion. Thump clear. Gourlay grabbed it clean. Does well to cut off the kick. Decides to go to the middle. Ball off hands. Handballs. Getting in the way was Allen. Squeezes out a handball. With the ball now. Has it now. Hits the target by hand. 
She gets above the crowd. 40 metres out. This shouldn't be too difficult for Malloy. She can put it through. Takes the chance and says thank you very much with that goal. Congratulated by her teammates. Collingwood behind by one. Thrashes it. Fowling. Onto the ball. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Williams sends one up towards the wing. Seth wins the foot race. Takes off now. Chose to kick it. Sharp. Marks uncontested. 50 metres from home. Going for goal number one. Horton takes a strong mark. Ten metres out. Okay. She blasted through for another. She's bagged a couple now. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around? Horton. Fremantle by seven points. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Fremantle have got on top in the contested possessions. It's one of the key reasons they lead right now. Gourlay contests the hard ball. Applies a bump. Finding the loose ball was Seth. Casey gathers it now. Casey was taken high in the tackle. Bangs it on the boot now. And the mark will be paid. Uses it now. The mark has been taken. Elects to kick. Fowler looking to track down the footy. Hurried kick. Finds this and marks well. Puts boot to ball. A clean pickup. Alexander just goes bang. Darcy finds possession. Takes a nice mark. Got boot to ball. Dug out the loose ball. Lambert releases it under pressure. Goal scoring opportunity for Hines. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. The ball ends up going to ground. Halftime sees Collingwood looking to improve the deficit of six. Fremantle have had a good first half. I think they'd really love to stamp their authority on this contest in the second. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? Fremantle trail in the clearance numbers, but it's not a big issue for them because of their defence. Cheers, Gaz. With so much on the line, I'm looking forward to this second half. Second half action about to commence. The game is back underway. Punched away. She's got the footy in her hands. Slicer missed an opportunity to mark. Just gets it onto the boot. Collects the loose ball. Receives the handball and takes off. Miller gives it off and now they go. Antonio moves it now. Nice mark under pressure. Dargan drives the kick. Livingston gets in a good position. Uses it across half back. Slicer controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Pumps the ball long. A great mark taken there. Lambert has resources out wide. Slams it on the boot. Allen couldn't keep her hands on it. Gives the old don't argue. Davy gets the loose ball. 
Bowers is blowing hard after that effort. Slicer wins it back. She gains the possession. Gourlay making her way onto the field. We'll get a ball up on the wing. The game has tightened right up. Hines got a fist to it. The loose ball scooped up. Antonio elects to kick. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Decides to kick. Marking in space with Bowers. Releases the handball. She can take off after that handball. The ball finds Livingston. Moves it by foot. It's a foot race to get this one. Dargan clears the ball from the contest. Uses it across half back. Finds a bit of room to mark. Kick by Alexander. Open opportunity for Davy. Looks to move it by foot. Good mark and looks to send it back. Goes by foot. O'Sullivan picks it up. Sinks the slipper into it. Terrific mark there. Goes by hand. She has the ball. Slips the handball to Maskell. Is in her possession. Gets the loose ball. Just gets the kick away. Thumps it clear. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Great mark under pressure. Looks up with the kick. Seth is the body to take that mark. She drives it towards goal. Always looked like a behind. Fremantle by seven. Livingston deciding where to go with the kick in. Uses it now. The umpire calls for the ball now. The players will be feeling the heat right now. Gathers it now. A poorly executed tackle there. Seth elects to kick. Spills the mark. Sharp. Slick with the hands. Greaves. Just put it on the boot. Stands tall and marks. Uses it by foot. Miller takes the mark uncontested. And there's the siren to end the third quarter. The scores are Fremantle 21 to Collingwood 14. The Dockers will be looking to not only hold their lead, but they want to put this beyond doubt early and run away with a big win. Leads all comers on the ground. She's having a fantastic game. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. Oh, they're going to take some risks now. They can't afford to waste any time. Swats it. Bowers made the tricky bounce look easy. Takes possession. Miller can link up through hands. Now we'll get a ball up. It's very tense at the moment. Darcy with the punch. Duffy couldn't complete the tackle. Slicer uses it by foot. 
mops up the loose ball. She likes her chances from here. Davy getting the crowd involved. There's nothing in this. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. Collingwood haven't been able to get the ball forward enough to score. They need to get some repeat entries inside 50 to generate some scoring. We resume hostilities. Hines thumps it forward. Kane coming onto the ground. And the umpire calls for a stoppage. Hammers it. Kane will be the recipient of the free. Ops for the short kick with quick hands. Taken by Lynch. They could take the lead here. Drop part straight through the middle. She celebrates hard after that. Collingwood could kick back-to-back -back goals. They're in the lead now. Thumps it clear. Up for grabs for Green. She's got the football now. Takes possession. Kane fends off the tackle. At full stride, receives the handball. With the ball now. She gets her hands on the footy. Showing some really good pressure there. She acknowledges the crowd. The Dockers goes back into the lead. That's a really good team goal. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. Back with another set of bounce. Darcy clears the contest, applying the physical pressure. Contests the hard ball, and the mark will be paid. Elected to play on. A chance to steal the lead right here. Does well to cut off the kick. Moved on by Gooch. Gets into a good position to take that. Moves the ball by foot. Williams found some space and marked. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Intercepts the ball very well. It's cut off by Green. Lynch there to mop up, hacking it out of there. Intervening brilliantly was Go Sullivan. Movement by hand. Gourlay found a way to mark that one. She spears the ball. Malloy marks in a bit of space. Puts it on the boot. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to her and give her some instructions. Picked up by Frazzle. Shevlin now. And now Rowe has to do better in that mark contest. Normally a pretty good kick. Let's see what she can do here. 50 metres out. Moving on. This is a big kick in the context of this game. A kick to hit the front. She loved that one. They've hit the front. Centre bounce. Hines with the hit. Gathered by Grieve. Charges with intent. Gives it to Antonio. Dargan picks up the loose ball. Great tackling technique. Intercepted. Sweeping handball from Lambert. Grant grabs that one. Big kick required from this distance. They're doing really well to choose some time off the clock here. She takes the mark. 45 metres out. Move it on. Can going for number one. Nice work from Malloy. Lining up from point blank range. Going for goal number two. Malloy loves that goal. 
Collingwood have kicked the last two goals. 11 points the difference. We resume hostilities. Winning it was Hines. Goal eight. Releases by hand. Fowler gets a quick kick away. The ball mopped up. Has to do better in that mark contest. A chance to put one through for her side. Might be too far out to score. Collingwood haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forwards. Fremantle came out second best in that matchup. Well, Gaz, how did you see that match play out? I thought we saw one side capitalise on their chances and the other didn't. And so often we see that determine the result. And thank you very much, Gaz. Collingwood have won the match against Fremantle, 38 to 27. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. Thanks, Hanno. Until next time, that is.